Spidey1958 and welcome to my Let's Play Industrial Automation. Um, I'm still having these weird lag spikes that seem to come at semi-regular intervals. So I'm going to redo some stuff here because the way I designed was rather uh, prone to lag spikes. So let's see here. Oh, that's right, and I took my engines out, or my invisible machines out, and put them back down. We will put them back down and see if it makes any difference. But it didn't seem to. It just seems like every couple seconds I get a huge lag spike for no apparent reason. Okay. Oops, didn't mean to quite go that far down. Okay. So let's see here. How am I going to make this work? <laughs> okay, so first thing I need to do is... Let's get stone pipes here. And let's get rid of this. And I had that in the wrong place. And I seem to have somehow broken a glass. We'll get that fixed in a moment. So is this where I want it? Nope, that's wrong too. Working on it, so it must be this one. Okay. These are going to get in the way. Well, maybe not. Let's see here. Okay, so I want one here. Whoops. Here. And here. And then I need suppliers.
got that part taken care of. Now I have to figure out how to get stuff into here. straight down here. Do I have an iron? I don't have... Oh, yes I do. Okay. So put an iron pipe here. That's fine the way it is. That's fine the way it is. So these two will go here and here. And I have to avoid there. Hmm, avoiding there may be difficult. No, no, it won't be. Okay. Now everything's going to go into there as it produces. Go ahead and grab some stuff out of here. So, this one will have thirty two cans in it. And the only thing it's going to produce out is water cans. Okay. This one will produce empty cans. And these. Okay. And that one doesn't change any. So this one will be empty cans and these. Okay. So this should be producing cans now, shouldn't it? Oh, but I don't have... And I want to build another pipe anyway. So let's run back here. And I'm completely lost to where I am in time in this, so... As usual, I plan to keep track and then I immediately get carried away and lose track. But I've been close to what I want in most of these. Okay, so I think if I order a switch and eh, I better look. That's
that's what I'm looking for and I need to turn this off again I replaced a couple pieces of equipment trying to figure out what the lag was and it didn't work destroying it and replacing it so okay so one oh, that's easy enough so I need a second lever my first lever. Maybe I didn't request it. Shouldn't be that hard to get levers, letters, people. Levers, that. There's the first one. So we put this and this together and we get one of these. The second lever should be here. Yep. Okay, so let's go sleep. legs come at bad times sometimes. Okay, so we'll go ahead and lay down this and this. I think this will work. And then we'll put the lever down. I think I can put it right on it, can I? Yep. And we'll go ahead and turn that on. So I should start getting water out. Yep. And the water should go around here and into there. Do I have a gold pipe on me? Of course not. Oh well. Play here. And I'll probably ultimately. some of my control circuits and figure out a way to control it so that it doesn't continuously use up all my tin. Okay. So we go ahead and click on this one. And we put half a stack of tin in it. And we allow partials. So then we'll put the tin here. Do, 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 do. That 
that's right. Okay. I guess I don't need that. And I need from here. From here, I need one of these. Okay, and then I pull these out. Whoops, that's not what I need. And I click there and tell it half a stack of these and do partials. Okay. So now the only problem I have is it's going to use up all my tin doing this stuff. So I think I may break the link here and do the tin normally. Hmm. Because it's going to recycle a lot of them. Yeah, let's go ahead. Let's leave it for the moment. Okay. So, I got my fuel system straightened out, and the whole thing will slowly shut down when I turn that off. So, we'll let it generate more fuel for the moment. And let's go make our superconductor part, and then we'll need to make some heaters. So I got the, uh, my things you requested last time and I've set them here so we can then make our rings. I ran them through the compressor of course to change them from the raw ingredients to this. So then we get these and we put these in a circle. And we get a superconducting coil. Now we need heaters. And there are three types of heaters and I don't know which one's better. We got our neutral beam, our RF cyclotron and our integrated heat whoops and our omnic. So let's just do one of each since we can have three types of heaters. So this one's really easy. Let's go ahead and request it. Assuming I can get my cursor on the right thing. So I need one circuit and seven wires. So let's get our seven wires. Or is it eight wires? No, it's seven wires. And we need one circuit. Okay, that's for the first one. For the next type of heater, we need a machine block, an advanced circuit, a refined iron, and one wire. So let's go ahead and machine block. One more 
wire, one advanced circuit, and one refined iron. Okay, and the other one, the third one, we need a frequency transmitter, an advanced circuit, and a machine block. So, a frequency transmitter. I should have tons of those that I made by mistake somewhere in here. I need one of those, right? I'm already forgetting. A machine block and a freq there's a frequency transmitter. And then a machine block. Let's go ahead and speed up stuff in the future by somewhere around here. I should have iron, 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 tungsten, flint, gold, iron. Wow, I'm actually beginning to kick into my resources here. So I'll go ahead and throw that in so that we have refined iron for our future projects. Okay. Okay, so our first one, if I remember right, was this with this. Okay, that gives us our first type of heater. Our second type was like that. So this, and this, and this, and this. That gives us our second type of heater. And our third type of heater I think we're waiting for, yep, another machine block, which we now have. <coughs> I think this one was this, and this, and this. And there we have our third heater. Now the next thing we need is an REI battery. A rechargeable battery, I guess I should have said. Do -do -do -do. Oh, and we need some glass fiber cable. Almost forgot that. Glass fiber cable, there you are. Okay, grab the battery here. Put it in here to charge. And let's go ahead and order some charcoal here for this. Okay. I think we have everything we need, but it looks like it's night out, so let's go sleep. I will off camera do some more research, see if I can figure out what causes these horrible lag spikes. They're very regular. And I haven't had problems with them for a long, long time. Where did I get seven? I thought I only ordered six. <coughs> As usual, I'm full of junk. Okay, that should get that recharging. And I 
think I'll go ahead and for the time being remove those. Okay, so if we put this here, put our three heaters in. And our charged battery. And well, I thought that would do it. It should do it. I have my fuel. I have my three heaters. I have a battery. What am I missing? And, oh, I'm missing this. My superconductor coil. There we go. Now it's charging up. Okay. should now be charging up. Yep. Now initially it's only going to produce a small amount of energy until I get some uh, some lithium-6 basically turned into trinium and then I'll be in better bit shape. But for now it's working. this is a good place to end the episode. I finally have my fusion reactor, reactor going. And I should find another place to send the power because it's going to fill that up fairly quickly. Well, not quickly, but it will fill it up ultimately. Excuse me. Looks like I got fuel there. So we should be in good shape. So I think we'll call the episode at this point. We have an actual working fusion reactor. And that, I'm not sure what I'll do next episode. Hopefully figure out what's causing my lag spikes. And that. Um, I am going to end this series when I can start up my new Let's Play. And currently I think all I'm going to do for the ending episode is big, do a big tour of all the world. So you can see all my devices and that. Um, if you guys have suggestions on how you'd like to see the series end, go ahead and let me know. I'd probably prefer not just to blow it all up, but that can be done if that's what we need to do. If that's what you guys decide. So, as always, th if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and give me a like, or better yet, subscribe. And if you didn't like it, give me a dislike, that's fine. But please leave a comment saying what you disliked about it. And that, so, and as always, this is Spidey1958, and have fun Minecrafting.